What is up everyone? This is a time again where I look at something from my collection and show it off to you guys. So here I have five Hanna-Barbera pencil sharpeners. This is like the fifth video I tried to see if I can get the fucking wording right, but this is the fifth one and this is the one that's going on YouTube. So, um, yeah, this is, um, these are pretty good right they are, but I'm missing only one, and that's the Huckleberry Hound one. He would be back right here, but... He's not here, so forget the bitch dog. It's about these ones right now, and uh, I gotta start right now. So we're gonna start off with my favorite, known as Top Cat. So, so here's Top Cat. He's in pretty pristine condition, as you can see right here. And uh, from what most collectors say, basically, you know, you know, they would always like to say, you know, what's you know, what's the difference between what other collectors and um, what I'm showing? Can anybody take a guess, really? If you've guessed that there is no defects whatsoever on this toy or this pencil sharpener, you are correct because this toy is one of my few that are in the like out of box condition, like as if this was like a brand new thing. And by the way, if you're all wondering what this is made of, it's ceramic. It sounds like glass, but it's actually not glass. So yeah, that's basically uh, Top Cat. Let's move on to. Um, Magilla Gorilla. So, Magilla Gorilla, not that bad of a design as well. No defects whatsoever. And, um, mint paint job like Top Cats, basically. So, yeah, this is a pretty cool toy as well. Or, not toy, but pencil sharpener. And, yep, if you didn't know, the pencil sharpeners were actually at the bottom right here, or at the back. And, um, yep, so basically, if you wanted to, like, you know, take this out and then store uh stored inside your pencil case or your art box and this is what you store pencils with so yep now what will we do next we'll do quick draw mcgraw so quick draw mcgraw it's not actually my personal favorite one actually i'd say this is probably my maybe last favorite i'm i'm not really a fan of this one as much as the other ones right there or as much as these ones but um Anyways, you know, despite it not really being my personal favorite, I think this is a really well-made pencil sharpener. And, um, like the others, it's spotless. So, yeah. The very first YouTube video review of this figure, of these figures, right here, and in the highest quality you will ever get, ever. Let's see what will we do next. We'll do um, Hair Bear Fag right here. So I'm guessing this is the Hair Bear Bunch one. Either that or it's Morocco. I don't give a fuck really, but I'm going to just call it Hair Bear Fag because I don't know much about the Hair Bear uh, Bunch or whatever it is. Uh, I'm guessing that's what it is basically. So decent paint job and once again, pencil sharpeners at the back. So yep. And I think that all these have different colored pencil sharpeners. I'm pretty sure it did. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, actually. And uh, here is the last one that I will be showing on video. This is Peter Potamus for all you confused people out there. Yeah, they do actually have different colors on their pencil sharpeners. Yeah, but, you know, everything else, just like the previous four, decent paint job. And these are pretty rare to find, especially in this kind of condition. I ended up paying about maybe $55, which is a stellar deal on these um, pencil sharpeners. And they're actually a bit heavier than I thought, actually. I thought there would be just like ceramic light, but I didn't think that ceramic was actually um, light at all. But like, I thought it was actually, I didn't even, I just didn't think it was that way. But you know, these are the five out of six pencil sharpeners. I will show you guys the Huckleberry Hound one uh, some other time. I'll put it on my social medias so you guys can see them. So yeah, basically for school supplies and everything like that, this is right up my alley. And I'm gonna put it, go ahead and put them back into the container they came in, and I'm gonna put, him, put the box back over it and store them hard as fuck in my secure cabinet and just let them rot in there. So yeah, so basically for everything like that, I give these figures a 10 out of 10. These are this is just right up my alley right here, and this is the you know a great addition to my collection. Okay, so if you're thinking about getting these figures, then I suggest you buy them now because they will skyrocket in price. And like I said in my previous ones, 
They will not be available for much longer, and they will be <sighs> rocket sky high. So I kid you not, actually. I, I urge you to buy these before they go 